Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, everybody. This is Yusuf Azhar. Wanted to uh, share a quick summary from a um, khutbah that Sheikh Hamza Yusuf delivered for the uh, MCC East Bay community. Um, this is for the Eid al Adha prayer, and this is he, uh, the one that he did in 2019. So let's jump right in. Um, uh, he focused a lot on Ibrahim alayhi salam. He talked about the lessons that we can get from his life around absolute submission to Allah, uh, also about patience in adversity, and about being grateful for blessings. He said this, uh, he had this quote, and it was a really good quote, which was that any person who wakes up secure, and that person also has a healthy body, that person has their provision, you know, their food and what they need for that day, it's as if that person has a whole world. Uh, another thing that he said that I thought was really good was that our Iman, our Iman, should be the same with Allah, whether we're up or we're down, regardless of our condition. Another thing he said was that Hazrat um, Ibrahim alayhi salam and our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, they would do the right thing regardless of whether people would criticize them and attack them or not. All right, one of the most interesting stories he brought up was about this guy named Kevin Hines. And uh, he said that, that Kevin Hines, he decided that he was going to commit suicide. So he goes to the Golden Gate Bridge and, in San Francisco, and then he um, he jumps off. The interesting thing is that he, he doesn't die. Instead, what happens is that he, a, a sea lion actually comes and holds him up until he gets rescued didn't die the sea lion comes he gets rescued and it's just this whole miraculous event but what's amazing is that that guy said that as soon as he jumped off the bridge immediately he regretted it he immediately regretted jumping off because you know his intention was to kill himself anyway i thought that was a beautiful story about how we should actually appreciate our life no matter how difficult it is another thing he said was about what to do in times of, of fitna like our in our time right and there's a lot of fitna and he said the process i actually mentioned that that there's going to be a time and there's going to be immense fitna and people are going to be confused so he was asked about what to do and he basically said to hold fast to the book of allah to kitab allah and uh, now I'm just going to get to uh, three action items that I personally took away from, from that khutbah. Um, number one, read, understand, and act on the Qur'an. Number two, we should choose to believe because belief is a choice. Okay, number three is that we should keep our faith, our iman strong and renew it through dhikr. All right, that's that's pretty much it. Um, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.